Hello everyone. In this video, I will tell you about factors influencing climate. Climate is influenced and controlled by certain factors like latitude or distance from the equator, altitude, humidity, precipitation and wind. Let's start with latitude or distance from the equator. It is one of the most important factors affecting the climate of a place. The places on the equator and close to it receive direct sun rays and maximum heat. The farther a place from the equator, the lesser heat it receives from the sun. Next factor is distance from the sea. The water bodies close to land affect the temperature of the place. During the day, the land gets heated up, whereas the water body is comparatively cooler. The cool wind from the sea blows towards the land and cools it. At night, the land loses its heat while the water body remains warm causing the cool wind from land blow towards the sea. This circulation of land breeze and sea breeze continue in summer as well as in winter. This way, water bodies close to land help to moderate the climate of these places. Next factor is altitude or the height of a place above the sea level. The higher a place is above sea level, the cooler is its climate. This happens due to the slanting sun rays and relatively thinner envelope of air. Earth is covered by a blanket of air, which we atmosphere. Kehte hain. Earth ki gravitational force atmosphere ko hold the atmosphere. So air thin hoti jati hai. Look at this picture of Mount Kanchanjanga taken from Darjeeling. 2500 meters higher than Darjeeling. As a result, while Darjeeling itself rarely gets snow, Kanchanjanga is permanently covered in snow. Direction of the wind blowing can also affect the climate of a place. Winds that come from over the water bodies bring moisture and rain to the land. The winds can be hot, dry or cold depending upon the regions they pass through and thus affect the climate of the area. The cool winds that blow in North India after snowfall in Shimla always drop the temperature of Delhi and surrounding areas in winter. Next factor is amount of moisture or humidity and precipitation. The amount of water vapor in the air is called humidity. Humidity is responsible for formation of clouds, rain and snow. Humid air increases Rainfall in the area and drier makes the climate drier. That is the reason why coastal lands receive more rainfall as compared to the inland areas. I hope that you have understood the topic well. Thank you everyone.